treatment today. Dry conditions proved once again any sort of burning right now needs to be done carefully or not at all. In Carleton County tonight, what started as a homeowner doing some burning in a barrel ended with their home and property destroyed. It happened after 5 p.m. off County Road 155 in Holyoke. CBS 3's Natalie Grant got there just as crews put out the flames and heard from a member of that family who's fortunate to be alive. We're still kind of shocked. Tyler Van Gilder and his family of five are without a home after a grass fire Thursday evening swept through their four acres of land, destroying their home and five other structures in its path. Once we seen the smoke start coming in the house, we knew the house was going to go up and we tried to get as much stuff out as we could. Van Gilder said the flames took over fast and before he knew it, the fire was out of control. Renshaw Fire Chief Peter Laveau says in these conditions, careless burning can be dangerous. It started, they were burning cardboard in a burn barrel and the wind caught the cardboard. And then it started as a grass fire spread to multiple buildings. And it don't take much, a little wind comes up and pretty soon it's out of control. Looking back in the destruction, Van Gilder says the material items can be replaced. He's just happy everyone made it out safely. I never thought it would happen to me, um, but it is what it is. You know, there's nothing I can do about it now besides just get everything cleaned up and I can't thank the fire departments enough, you know, everybody that showed up to help. No other injuries were reported. Van Gilder and his family say they'll be staying with friends and family until they're able to find a new home.